seen one thing, um, the coupling type of, the coupling device for my daughter's B12, it's, it's, it's acceptable on this because it's, it's an old model. I mean, very old, this, this loco's over, over 40 years old now. And again, she's still pretty much, she's pretty much fully intact. Well, she's lost, what was it, a whistle or safety valve on there? Yeah, there's meant to be two of those. There's a bit of a hole, I'm not sure if the camera will pick it up. Bit of a hole, um, just a bit of a, a snapped hole just below the front of the boiler. And, and again, one of the front pony truck wheels, I think it was one of the front, far front ones, but on the other side, on the other side, broke in half, but I, I managed to glue it back in place. And she's lost a number sticker, sadly, on this side of the cab. It's on the, it's on the, it's on the other one. I can't see it there. So yeah, um, you probably know what this is. Or this is probably reminding you of um, the the LMS, was it, was it LMS Caledonian single wheeler. It has the same coupling device as this. <laughs> yeah. Um, again, see, I see 82's review on that. Um, but yeah, I'll just say now this is exactly the same, but it's acceptable because she, because she's an old 40 year old model. But it's a little bit outdated on a on a newer model like that like a single wheeler so yeah just that uh just that quickly um oh, there's, a bit of a, there's a bit of a hair on the side there there, there we go so yeah on this it's it's acceptable but on a newer model especially in a super detail box no if you just put that on the track right this loco's over 40 years old i wonder I'm not sure what we'll get, but oh, just a bit more power there. I said I would um, hopefully do a video of this of this locomotive running, just a, a bit faster. She could die. She could conk out any second, at any point. And there's, I can see we should come and pick it up. But there was a, there was maybe not as many, but there was a fair few sparks coming from the wheels. Oh my god, are you seeing, are you, are you seeing this, look at that! My dad's B12, which is approaching 43, 44, if not maybe 45 years, oh you see the spark there, if not pro pro approaching 45 years old and running. Oh, this is gonna, oh, it's gonna almost put me in tears, with tears of joy, I guess. The happiness, yeah, you can just see a bit of a hole there, but oh my goodness. This is unbelievable. This is just unbelievable. Look at that! Look at that running, that is, that, that is just amazing. That is unbelievable. Let's just get I cannot believe that, and I never thought I would film this loco running so soon. Oh my word. Look at that 43 year old, uh, 43 year old engine. Again, we did run her. A couple of times with the standard train controllers, like the one I got with Scotsman's train set. Um, and uh, she was okay at first, but I don't think she didn't respond that well to them. I don't think she was that keen, but she seems to be getting used to the HM2000. Oh, this is oh good. This is definitely going to be one of the highlights of this year. Again, I, if I do a, a 2013 highlight video at the end of the year, this will definitely this will definitely be in it. Oh, oh, there goes that smell. Oh. Again, still doesn't beat how bad the one his old his, um, his old DMU one um, um, did once. I took some fresh air, so I'm feeling sick. But oh my goodness, I'm pleased to present my dad's B12 finally running. Why oh, is always a spark there? And there could be a few more, but oh my goodness! Again, she could stop at any point, but no, oh, this is this is like ten times better than I thought. This is. Well, I actually gave it a little try without her body and before I started filming this and she was very reluctant. So I thought, well, maybe a few more tries. Maybe a few more tries. If it doesn't turn out good enough, I'll just have to cancel the video because I've been uh, putting filming her, filming her just constantly stopping. But oh my goodness. Just trying to come around oh, this way. Again, here's the box she's come out of. Look at that. Just look at that. Oh, she's definitely letting off the smell though. Sorry, the camera wouldn't zoom out there. There we go. Again, old box wheel stuff in there, an old 19, 
mid 80s newspaper. Well, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, here she is. Again, I never, to be honest, I, my thoughts of when I would do this video, I would film his oldest loco running. I, I'm so shocked that it's come so soon. Some of you have probably been waiting and wondering when my first reaction was, well, I can't really see it being any time soon, but we are shocked now, aren't we? We are very shocked. Let's just try and get a better shot of her over here. Probably more. Again, it's, again it's, it's not a button, just a touch system. Just zoom out on this camera. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a good camera, but it doesn't always respond yet because it's got a number on there. That is B12, number 61572. Oh, just, just not the camera there. Oh, because I'm just full of excitement now. 61572. Is it possibly Tryon Hornby? My dad's oldest loco running. Yep. Not a loco that's over 40 years old running like that is just absolute amazement. It looks like there'll be some more videos of her. Of her coming up, possibly even as a rolling stock. Well, um, well, the way she's running now, that that thought's getting higher. But at first, it, it was extremely doubtful. But unbelievable.